of our Lift and Go 2. It's our most basic model, kind of our introductory version. I'm going to tell you a little bit about it. The base, as you can see, is all welded, so it comes together in one piece. This particular lifter has our UH and W platform with the frame on the bottom. If I wheel it around to the back, you can see that there's an adjustable handlebar. So you unscrew, move it up or down based on the ergonomically friendly height, screw it back in. We also have a removable remote control, so you can walk around the lifter if you're trying to line it up with a drop-off point. It's a simple up and down function. This is our battery. It's a 24 volt battery. You can see the battery indicator here. To the right, it's fully charged. On the back, there's a charging port. We just ask you to charge it when you're not using the lifter. And then the last feature is our brake system. You'll see the little bars down here. You just kick them on, locks the brakes, doesn't move, and when you're done, you can kick them off quickly. And I'll show you a little bit about how it works. You can see all the casters are swiveling when the brakes are not on. Really easy to move around. That, and then I'll show you how to pick up a box and kind of demonstrate what we do with the lifter. So you'll wheel it to your product. You can go up or down on the remote, trying to get the perfect height. And go about here, and then you'll want to kick on the brakes to make sure the lifter doesn't move when you're not ready. And then you will take the box, in my case, and move it on. At this point, when the load is secured, you'll take the brakes off. And then you can move the lifter to your desired location, use the remote to lift the platform, and proceed with your application.